Hey everyone, this is Super Crabble Tree. Um, quick update. This is like the third time I've tried doing this stupid update. I'm sorry, but uh, um. Anyways, uh, my camera. Like I said, I really hate this camera, and it messes it up every single time I try to do a video. So hopefully, it won't mess it up this time. So. Um, anyway, so I got, I've halfway sheared my Angora buck right here. He's extremely beautiful sheared. Um, but when I did shear him in the one, it's okay, one side right here, when I did shear his back right here, it made it darker for some reason. And then right here is way lighter, so the rest of it may turn darker again. Um, this is his dad. You know, can't believe it, but this is his dad, son. Um, so yeah, and anyways, um, this is her, his daughter, um, half sib siblings to him. Um, but sad news, she ha has like an infection down in the bad area that, and it can't be fixed like any, like it can't, you know. Um, so we're going to be butchering her today for sure because she, we don't want her suffering anymore. She's uh, She cut herself on her cage or something uh, the other day and it's just been getting worse. So we are going to put her down. Um, then Calypso, my old buck over there, um, he's probably going to be put down in about, well, at the end of this year anyways, if he lives through the whole year. Um, he's four or five now, um, so he's really old, so he, he's probably going to be put down at the end of this year. Um, I'm going to have a couple more litters out of him, so his, you know, his, there will be babies out of him, since, you know, this is his baby right here. I love her to death. She's, she's amazing. She loves to hop around and play, and um, she actually does sit still when um, you go to show her. Uh, actually, I will take her out right now and show her you guys um, really fast. Move, Lily. She actually just sits there normally. Um... She actually has been getting has been getting really good. She uh, does normally just sit there like a good girl. Um, she has a really nice big head. Um, she's short in the shoulder. I can probably only fit one finger in there, so she's pretty short. She doesn't rise high enough. She doesn't have enough depth. So um, I'm gonna have to get a buck that has depth, more depth to breed to her. Um, and that's pretty much it. She, uh, a person came over and looked at my rabbits, and she said. She really likes this little doe because the only thing she doesn't have is the depth. Uh, she doesn't rise high enough. So I really like this little girl too, especially since she's a broken black. Broken blacks are a little bit more rare, but the blues are the rarest right now to me. Or the blue fawn harlequins. <coughs> Excuse me. Um, But yeah, anyways, the uh, these guys are the... I would say fourth rarest out of the French Slop colors. I really love her though so much. Um, and good news, uh, Cool Dude did give birth uh, last night around 11 p.m. So that's pretty really, that was really weird to me. Um, I was shearing my one rabbits last night and when we came out here I saw her pulling some fur. So yeah, she gave birth around um, 11 last night so she was born yesterday practically. Uh, uh, the 8th not the 9th and uh, I'll be put it, uploading photos to my website today um, so if you want to go on there you can look on there I'll probably end up uploading the photos onto my website before I upload the, this video so you can go on there uh, after you're done watching this video where are you going um, if you want anyways if you don't want to it's fine um, anyways so I'm going to put her back So anyways, um, sorry for making this video already four minutes long when I haven't even done really anything yet. So, um, <clears throat> but everybody's doing really good in here. Um, I'll show you the babies. I took the pictures this morning, um, or er, earlier this morning. Um, <sighs> oh, 
which I want to take this fur out because um, they're probably way too hot in here. Um, and I see the flies are getting in there because I see that um, mom gave birth to uh, one of those thingies in here. It's a baby, I don't know. I wish I should just get that out because the flies are going in there. She gave birth to um, a blood thingy. Anyways, um, I was saying, uh, yeah, there's five babies, a harlequin. I think this is a black or a chinchilla. Um, there's a broken opal, a black orange tricolor, and a broken chinchilla if I didn't say that already anyways so I'm gonna take some of this out so they don't get overheated while the winds blowing right now um. so yeah that's them Um, I'm going to put this fur into one of these bags, this one I guess, and um, these babies, I took the nesting box out since it's been getting way too hot over here. I'm probably going to have to move um, these guys out of here because it's been getting way too hot right here. Um, I'm probably going to move her into... That black cage over there that the Angora buck is over in. Because I'm going to move the mom over there and then the babies can go into the carrier cage that I have over there. Because it's way too hot over here. So. And then. these All these guys in here are doing really good. Um, oh and uh, I almost forgot to say. Uh, I lost his brother to the heat uh, about two or three days ago. Um, I moved the cage. That, it wasn't over there where it is, but I moved the cage into, like, uh, next to the, my shed. Uh, and the sun hit him, and he laid right down into the sun, and he overheated. So, pretty sad about that. Um, but anyway, so. <clears throat> so, everybody else in here is doing pretty good. I uh, sheared her, too, yesterday. Um. Uh, I didn't cheer, but my mom and my cousin did. Both of them did, and they do a really choppy job. <laughs> um, uh, and anyway, so this dose due on the, I think, 16th or 17th. Uh, and I'm going to be shearing all of the Angoras. Try to anyways today and tomorrow. Um, that's pretty much it uh, that I have to update. Oh, and... Uh, no, I haven't gotten my alpacas yet, so I'll probably do an update when I do get them, so. So, yeah, and that's pretty much it. Uh, if you have any questions, you can ask me. And please subscribe if you like my channel. Um, so, yeah, that's pretty much it. So, I guess I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.